Hi, everybody. We're over at Justin's today. Again, we were here a couple weeks ago, and he was um, getting his harness just adjusted for his horse that he wants to start driving around. So we're going to... We are back to do some more um, adjusting and to actually drive the horse around. He actually got a part of a britchin from me, and so with that and what he had, he has made a pretty good harness now, and he's got it adjusted up pretty nice. He did a little bit of sewing on this britchin right here, but uh, because of the parts I gave him, which is a nylon harness, um, it has come out quite well. So these are the britchin that he got from me. He's got to adjust this, I mean, put another hole in here and make this one a little bit shorter, but that's not a problem. We can do that simple enough. And then the straps to go to the to the hames. That one looks like it's a little bit long, but I guess it's not. It's just the way it's sitting there. But even if it was, it's simple enough to adjust that. So he's in pretty good shape as far as the harness goes. As you can see, he got a different collar, and that f fits the horse a lot better. I told him he could just actually put some black tape right there and help hold that together. The nylon's a little bit stiff, but that would work good. Those tugs look kind of rough, but they'll still be fine for what he wants to use his horse for. He does have quite a problem with his one one foot on his horse. He did a little trimming on it the other day, but he said he told him he's really got to take care of that. It's got quite a bad crack in it, but uh, it's a simple fix. He's just got to trim it up so he can get that done at some point. A little small. It, it really is. Yeah. Well, we can pull that pad out, did not yeah, oh, but I, I love pad. a pad. I, I, yeah. I tell you, I just like a pad. And I'm telling you, I got you, a thinner pad that was longer. Yeah, but it's 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 probably by the time she starts working into that, she'll shrink down. I bet it's gonna be just about right, actually. Yeah. So. Yeah. And this is good. Um, just yeah. to. You need to have something to keep it down. Or or tight to here. Yeah. See. Yeah. Put something in. Yeah. Even something that. like that would work. Yeah. Yeah, I was talking with Henry. He he mentioned that too because he saw me driving. Uh huh. I drove her all the way down to the end, just walking behind her. Just yeah. The other day. And she did that good. Yeah, she did. Yeah. Okay. She does that fine, but then you go and you put a hook or two, try and just stop her and hook her to anything. She gets pretty worked up. Okay. So you do have a, a whipple tree? Yeah, right. I wouldn't hitch onto that tire. Did you, were you trying to drag this around? Yes, yeah. yeah, I wouldn't drag that around. Not yet. Too big. Oh, you got hitched like that. That's yeah. quite a whoop tree. Yeah. It's a lot wider than you really want or yeah, really need. I that. It doesn't hurt though. Yeah. It doesn't hurt. But that's a great setup, but. I do have a smaller one that came with that cultivator. It's only about like that wide. Uh -huh. But what I would do is I would take this right off. Right. Which is simple enough to do. Yeah. And you can just drag that around. Right. Don't drag that, just drag this. Yeah. And then just take a chain and hitch it onto a piece of firewood. Yeah. You know, yeah. And, and, and build up to that. Now that yeah. seems like that should be nothing. Yeah. I mean, but, she, she did hold it. Right. But she didn't. But like, there's just care. something about tire, too. They tend to. Noisy. noisy and they tend to slide back and forth. Whereas if you just had a, just a small piece of firewood behind, you're farther ahead. And to start with, just drag the whip trees. So. Yeah, just put it at the longest length. Yep. 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 And then also, you could also practice. I worry about those things hitting their heels too. Well, sure, like if you got it long enough. Yeah. yeah. These are are not what you would normally have either. No. That's not. I'm just going with what I have. Yeah, and that'll work. That'll work. But if you have the whipple tree, then you could practice to turn around. Is that what you said? You try to get her over here, she wouldn't behave? Well, what I, yeah, she just, she didn't like to stand so that I could hook anything. I did get her one time, she stood fine, but when I hooked her under this, and then right. she didn't, after that, she didn't really want to stand any time I tried to hook her. Uh -huh. Even with Bethany there. Do you, do you have a, a chain, heavy chain, or just any chain? Yeah, I've got, I've got a couple. You just hit, uh, let that drag also. Just drag the chain. Okay. Just see what happens. 
is if you have just enough weight that holds that tight so she's yeah. less apt to hit there yeah see what i mean yeah whereas if that's loose it's more apt to yeah so yeah i've got i've got another chain over here good heavy one would be nice but it's really yeah, anything i had one i don't know what happened to it there you go mm, if I... <clears throat> yeah i would take a lot off these these yeah. toes still see right there I can't see the white line because that, but I would go right yeah. like there. See that whole yeah. corner would come off. Yep. She picked her feet up really nice. She does, but she does like to lean on you. Right. Well, especially on the front. So what you want to do is flatten that right down, but then mm -hmm. you really want to get like that. Yeah. And this like this. You get that toe right off. Nice curve there. But that's it. Definitely needs to be ta taken care of. It's not a big deal. Yeah, I have. I need to get a different halter because I don't really have one that I can. Halter or bridle? Oh, well, I just need to get a lead rope that I can just clip in. I don't have one, so I, I don't like putting the leaving the halter on. At this stage, you're better off. Don't put leave the halter right on. Yeah, when I was riding her, I put her. You know, she stands you fine. Took it right off. Yeah, but it's nice because then you can just tie this to your hame and you've got it. I mean, I don't like halters. I hate halters, but I don't. There's times it's just as well to use them, yeah. you know. And I'll use them like training colts and such. I'll, I have halters on. Okay. I shortened these up a little bit. The lines? The lines, yeah, they were way too. Oh, okay. And I actually used some of that strapping on different things. I went. Uh, Disc in this morning, I wish mine were a little bit longer. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Make sure you get that on the inside of those lines. Yeah. 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 yeah these lunge lines are really long. They and they're they're not heavy at all. No, they work fine. Um, they work fine, and they're what you got. bringing her down. Oh really? So I kind of feel like she must not be pregnant. Oh yeah, that's right. Probably not. She should be rolling right now. She's not even close. You just make the circle and put that whoop tree right on and see what happens. Yeah. See how she does around that. <laughs> you mean the cutting the corner for you? Is that yeah. what you mean? Yeah. No, partly, the partly the truck too, yeah. If you want to. Just to go down the grass, I'll hold her and you can put the wolf tree on. Oh. oh. Just a second. There. There. Oh. There. You're, you're gonna, that's, that's fine. You're gonna, um, oh. that's right, let her fight it a little bit. I think it's good for her. I'll stand right there and just see what she does. Um, um, you probably ought to take that chain off because it's just gonna be right in your way. <laughs> You could be stepping on it. The idea of a chain, something dragging is good, but, but, uh, now is there a lazy strap on that other side? Lazy strap. On the tarp, the lazy strap. This, this here is the lazy strap. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh. A lot of it was the weight and the sound and stuff, and she could see that tire behind her. Right, right. 
Adam, she wants to go where she wants to go. A lot of things too in situations like this. I wouldn't try to make her stand. Go. Tell step. Because she's not at that stage yeah. to teach that yet. Right. And all you're gonna do is get in trouble. They don't have like a two by four or something to to hitch behind her. Um you don't mind getting dirty. You want something just like a one piece of firewood or, or one two by four. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Like that. You notice also I don't tell her to step because she really doesn't know that. Right. You can easily get her to know that out over time. Yeah. If that's, what, if that's the command you want to use. Yeah. But, uh, you know, the, the kissing noise seems to work better. Yeah. Okay. Careful. Careful. How much pressure I'm putting on your bed. Yeah. She's sensitive. I think that's what the problem that I was running into was putting too much pressure and then she'd really oh, turn. I think so too. And I'm then good. and then we get into a seesaw match, you know. Yeah. Which wasn't good, so. Oh. Yeah, I'm not even pulling the lines. She's mine is a good she's stopping on those. Yeah. She's smart. She's a, she's a smart little horse. See, I, I, I'm so used to the step. And if right. That's what you want to teach you, just well, say step and then... I figured I may as well. I'd, I'd say step and then smooch a little bit yeah. and then eventually stop smooching. But, because uh, I mean, when we're using your horses, that's oh. what we're, I've oh. gotten used to. But if she doesn't stop, you've got to put a little pressure on that. As soon as she stops, release that so she doesn't have that. Yeah. I think she's going to make you a really nice horse. Yeah. She's really good when I'm riding her. Like, she'll side pass. She she does a lot. I mean, just with leg pressure and stuff like that. Oh. Hey Justin, bring her over here. I'll show you how to hitch back onto that while you're when you're alone. I say I will. I, I'll try. Okay, stop her right there. So if if I'll let you take the camera, you can video it. I, I may not be able to do it, but this is what I do do when I'm hitching on. <laughs> She looks calmer already from Between those mm -hmm. 
fingers in such a way that you can straighten her up. And, right. And, and you gotta, you gotta almost sense when she's gonna do it before she does it, because if she goes too far, yeah, it's too hard to bring them back. Yeah. If you catch them just as they're, just as the head's starting to go, yeah. yeah. So. Justin, while I'm here, why don't we try once on the tire just to go around this small loop and then I gotta get going. Okay. Yeah, you just hook it through the regular hook. And however, actually. Back. Back. Oh. 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 Yeah, that's good. That's chain drag. Perfect. I kind of figured it was mostly something I was doing. She's definitely better for this tire. Yeah. I didn't think she was earlier, but definitely. And that hookup with the chain is just fine. It's a lot easier. Right. You can unhitch and do other things. Yeah. Oh. I think I was over, over steering in a way, you know. Well, she's like, got a tender mouth. Right. But like after driving, you know, a team, and they're pretty strong headed. Yes, she, you know, huge difference. She's like, yeah, a lot different. So, but that, I, I hadn't realized that. That was tough. And perfection is what you shoot for. Yeah. But if she's not standing and causing trouble, just go. Right. You know, right. don't don't try to make her stand there. It's just not worth it at this stage. Try and make it sound like it's your idea. Yes. Right? Yeah. Right. And it's, it's she'll get the better hand at times. It's just yeah. just the way it is. Trying to end on a good note. Yeah, yeah. Not even I would stay off those stones as much as possible. Yeah. And yeah. right there in the end, yeah. fine, but. Uh. For feet and stuff. No, just because of the noise, you better make a sharp turn. Okay. Good for it to turn sharp corners. Perfect. Those, those corners are awful good for the horse. Yeah. Learns them how to spin the chart. She's standing right there. Oh yeah, I think she's doing great. Well, thank you. You're welcome. I appreciate it. Yep. Thanks a lot. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow.